Hey guys, welcome back to SourceFed. I'm Steve Zaragoza. And I'm William Haynes. U.S. citizens rejoice! It is now 100% legal to flip off a cop. <laughs> boyaka, boyaka. <laughs> Hypertension! Okay. It's true. According to a 14-page opinion issued by the U.S. Court of Appeals, the quote, ancient gesture of insult is not the basis for a reasonable suspicion of a traffic violation or impending criminal activity. One time, I wrote a 14-page opinion about Vons and John's grocery stores, and no one read it. They sound too similar. It has to be a copyright infringement. This ruling comes hot off the tails of a case involving a man and his wife who were forced to go to court to battle it out with two police officers that arrested the man because he flipped off the cop who was using a speed radar at an intersection in St. Johnsonville, New York. The man was charged with disorderly conduct and was followed home and arrested. The officers say the reason why they followed him home was because one officer thought he was trying to get their attention and wanted to make sure there wasn't a domestic dispute or some kind of emergency. Wait, what? Can you do that? Can cops do that? I mean, if duty call. Protect and serve. Ooh. But it didn't matter. The judge ruled that the cops had no rational reason to pull the man and his wife over just because he flipped them off and said, quote, the nearly universal recognition that this gesture is an insult deprives such an interpretation of reasonableness. Praise logic. Praise logic. So there it is, kids. Flip off a cop if you want to. They may get real mad and pull you over for something you may not have been pulled over for that you can't fight, like an expired registration or a broken taillight, but at least you can say you flipped off a cop and you're a vigilante or just a douchebag. Cool. So what's the worst reason you or someone you know has been pulled over by a cop, let us know. Hey man, let's go flip off some cops big time. All right.